are here in Tennessee. Why are we here, Tyler? To ride coasters and Christmas. <laughs> we are going to be going to Dollywood, but right now, since Dollywood doesn't open until two o'clock, we are doing an alpine coaster, which is basically a coaster in the mountains. It is currently 28 degrees outside. We are the only people here because we're crazy. You can see our breath. It snowed all last night and it's pretty magical. We've never seen snow before, so this is our very first time. That alpine coaster was a lot of fun. We didn't really use the brakes at all and it was really cool. It took us like deep into the mountains. I wish I could have filmed it, but I couldn't really take anything on there. We are planning to do another one at some point on this trip, so we will see how they rank. But right now, we are about to grab lunch at this cute little place called Mel's Diner. It's so cute. It just looks like a classic little diner that you'd see like in a movie or something. Look how cute it looks. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> what did you get? <laughs> Grand Pappy's Pot Roast. Ooh. Reminds me of Cracker Barrel with the sides. <laughs> And then I got the mushroom burger. So we finished lunch at Mel's Diner. How was it? Really good. Yeah, I enjoyed it a lot too. The service was great because everybody's so nice here in Tennessee. They got that Southern hospitality and we loved it. So now we're at this roadside attraction called the Jurassic Jungle Boat Ride. 2.4 uh, stars. We're mostly just here to kill some time because Dollywood doesn't open until two o'clock. So let's go see how terribly good this is. Wow, look at this high tech animatronic. This intense fight. This is better than dinosaur. <laughs> ah, he's coming for us. Little baby dinosaur's hatching. Identify. Oh. Tyrannosaurus. His neck. His neck is broken. <laughs> Why does he move like that? He's running. He's running. Oh my god. What the hell is that? there for a minute and then finally the effects would start to kick in and lights would come on and we would see some dinosaurs there were some pieces missing from dinosaurs um honestly kind of terrifying like that giant creature t-rex looked like the mind flayer from oh, yeah, that stranger one. things um very scary i don't know if i would recommend this for children <laughs> nightmare fuel we made it Yay. 
to Dollywood. Ah! Our brain wants to tell us that this is just fake snow for show, but it's real on all of these Christmas trees. First things first, we're going on rock and roadway. <laughs> We are. If you stop moving while you're still grooving. This is our car. We got flames on it. <laughs> There's lightning rod. <laughs> We're about to ride the barnstormer, but not the one in Magic Kingdom. Not gonna lie, I was a little bit terrified on that ride. My eyes were closed most of the time, but I made it through. We're here getting ready to watch Christmas in the Smokies. So this show is singers and dancers performing Christmas music with a live band. I'm pretty excited because Christmas is my everything. Cinnamon bread delivery. What is this thing even called? That is so cool. So we got cinnamon bread, which Dollywood is known for. It looks so delicious. We also got a side of icing with it. Can't wait to try. How is that, babe? That's Better than the cinnamon? Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is so delicious and good. Get a little bit of icing. It's got like some crunch on the top here. We're here at Eagle Mountain. It's like a refuge for eagles that can't fly, right? Or have been hurt. So we just went on one of the only rides that's open right now. What ride was it, babe? Blazing Fury. It was good. It was uh, kind of like a little family coaster with a few drops here and there, but lots of animatronics. It was like a dark ride at the same time, so it was pretty cute. But um, not much else is open because of the weather. So that's like the only disappointment because we really want to go ride the coasters. They're not open. Luckily we have a second day tomorrow so we're really hoping they're open tomorrow. It's so quiet. It's so weird. Like the entire park is just kind of slow. There's not that many people here. It's a little bit eerie. When in snow, gotta make a snowball, right? It's like the rite of passage. Oh god, I can't even make a correct snowball. Can you tell? I live in Florida. <laughs> this is my snowball making skills. I'm sure this looks really pretty at night, but they have all these twinkling lights hanging down from the trees. As you can see, there's lots of snow on the tracks here. I just used this icicle to write our initials. It's a real icicle. We're entertained by the smallest of things because we're not used to the cold. They've got the Christmas tree here. They're gonna have a lighting later that we are coming to see. It's very nice and peaceful, pretty much everywhere in the park today. And Polar Bear was able to ride his sleigh all the way to the Smoky Mountains. Black Bear was so happy to see his cousin. And Polar Bear was so happy to see Black Bear. They played and sang and decorated their tree. Excited and happy to spend their Christmas together. that it is a great gift to get to spend time with our family and friends. Young and old, the holidays. Sweet tea, which Tyler says is really good. 
and they just brought out cheddar biscuits, which look and smell delicious. Update, this biscuit is so good. It's like eating a delicious cloud. <laughs> What'd you get, babe? I got roasted chicken. Looks good. Comes with mashed potatoes and green beans. I am obsessed with these sparkling butterflies. They're so pretty. And there's so many lights all over the place. We just got some hot chocolate. Warm up before we see the parade. <laughs> Just like sitting in there. We just finished watching the parade. It was cute. It was nothing like Disney scale, but it's a smaller park, so I'll still give them credit. And that pretty much sums up our day here. We did everything we could with the ride closure, so we're really hoping that they are open tomorrow. What was your favorite part of the day? Spending it with you. Thanks. Goodbye, humans.